Hello and welcome. Let me see. This is the store. I'm gonna search for tweak tools. For tweaks. Okay, I'm interested in genome tweaks. Okay, I think that's all I need to install from here. Basically, it's not gonna take you far if you if you look for. For tweak, you'll see, and you can change the template. Um, I personally like a different template, this one right here. But I'm gonna just leave it as default for now. So I'm gonna just close this for now. As you can see, if you go to extensions, it comes with this two extensions, but. This is not going to do much to us, so uh, or, or I need I need the dash to panel. So in order to, to download dash to panel, you, you can't basically download this from the store because it's not there. I look and feel free to look. To download dash to panel, you need to go to GNOME extension store or website. Okay, basically I'm gonna just look for a dash to panel gnome and it should take me to extensions and then as you can see you can install extension to Chrome add okay and then you see this foot right here. See, yeah, the problem is the the shell is not installed. So I need to install that uh, gnome shell to be able to do that. Okay, what you need to do is do sudo apt get install, and then you need to put Chrome. Uh, genome, I think it's purge by shell. Okay, I think that's all I need from, from here. Let's see, now I need to, to refresh. Okay, you can get it I'm gonna look for a dash to panel. Okay, here we go. Now you can just install it from here. Stop. As you can see, it's really, really fast. It's already. We already made progress. See? We already have a nice Windows like uh, menu. But you can do better than that. Okay, let's look for, uh, I'll come back later to tweaks. Let me go back to extensions. And then now I need, I need arc menu. This is the only two extension I really like. Okay, so that's all we need from Chrome. And close everything. Okay, uh, now we need to to just basically uh, change. Let me first change the background. Change background. Feel free to to use your own wallpapers. Let's see how this thing looks. Mm, doesn't look bad. Okay, we'll just leave it like that for now. Let me just close this. You just they don't like things out of focus. Um, so let me just change it probably to something else. Mm, let me try this one. 
Okay, this one looks better, I think. Okay, the second thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go arc cleaner, I'm gonna do for tweaks. And then from tweaks, I will go to extensions. And then you can see now these two added. This is what I need. Uh, the first thing I will do, I'm gonna just a little bit um, give this one uh, some opacity. A little bit, not too much. I'll just use default. I'm gonna just turn in. Okay, this looks good. Uh, second thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just change the icon on on this arc menu. Uh, the default doesn't look this this impressive. Okay, so that's a gear icon. And let's see, go to appearance. Arc menu icon. I think it's this one. Then here we can choose uh, some icons. I personally like this one. I like this one. And they usually give it 32. Okay. Okay, well, it wasn't that much really, we didn't spend much time making it look like this, it was fast and um, I think, I think it looks awesome like this, I don't know about you but to me, uh, this this actually pretty good looking. Uh, you can change basically the colors if you want. Like uh, if you go to go back to tweaks, if you wanna change the, the appearance of windows, I usually use this um, this theme, not deep, dark one, and also uh, extension. Uh, you can basically, if you want to change the, the color, the override the theme, and basically if you want it to, if you want it to be dark, like uh, problem it doesn't have, uh, I think opacity. I would like to see some opacity here change because you can just change the, the background like this menu right here can change the background and, and stuff like that but so what I really want to change uh, not not change override the theme but um, you can do that if you want um, what I really want to change is the, the font size I usually make it 11 so it's in sync with other uh, with other uh, font on the, on the system. So as you can see, they are a little bit bigger, but this one is. Uh, I wish there's a way that you can actually squeeze this one here. But if you don't like that, you can just turn it back. But I usually just leave it. Uh, usually leave it default. You see. We go to tweaks. Uh, let's go to our menu. It's appearance, and then just change this all together. And now it should return to back to normal. Um, we can go back to theme. Choose this one. This one, you may like it if you like uh, black and orange. I personally like uh, black and yellow or orange or something like that. Okay. Well, this is Ubuntu, the latest version. And this is how you customize the desktop. I hope you like this video and if you do make sure to press that like button 
and if you want to share this with your friends that would be awesome and if you want more videos like this please subscribe and uh, make sure to hit that bell icon so when i upload the videos you'll be notified uh, thanks again have a nice day bye